Hello YouTube, it's me Kelly. Uh, sorry about uh, yesterday's video. Today is going to be day 16 and 17's video. Uh, day 16 and 17. Um, because I didn't make a video yesterday and I do apologize. I had company that came unexpectedly. My daughter had brought her father over. Um, because we're still really good friends. And uh, he, uh, basically my best friend other than my husband is a male host. Um, other than my boys, should I say, my sons. But today's going to be 16 and 17. Um, had them come over, and the time got away from me. Um, it was already 12, 30, quarter to 1 when I realized, oh, wow, I didn't do the video. Anyway, um, so I do apologize, but today is going to be 16 and 17. Yesterday, uh, I stayed on plan with everything. Let me see if my paper's up here. My paper's probably not up here. My room right now is, a. Uh, am going through boxes and stuff, and I didn't get that done yet. Got a lot of it done, but not what I wanted to. Anyway, basically, um, had to force myself yesterday to do a mile. I was under calories. I did do a mile, but I was under calories, but by the time I went to bed, I still had like, uh, I think 84 calories. I can't remember. Um, the paper's probably in my little sack, but I'm not going to get up and get it. I'm just going to let you know that I was on track with my water. I did one mile, but I just did not want to eat. Mother Nature still has not hit me. <laughs> so, you know, I know I keep telling you guys that, but it, that it, this is part of going through, you know, this is part of me being, I just turned 50. Today is my birthday, so going through menopause. And um, so that's why you're seeing all these little blotches. It's affecting my skin. And I don't really wear makeup. I mean, every now and then I'll put a concealer on to conceal them, but mm, I just wear eyeliner, basically, that's it. But I will, every now and then, put some makeup on. Very, very rare. But, um, anyway, I just wanted to get this video up today. Okay, I was off track yesterday. I was just, I wasn't off track. I ate, but I ate, like, um, I had for breakfast, I had, I was under calories, I was way under calories um, in the beginning, but then I ended up getting them in later on last night. I was up till 3 or 4 in the morning. So I got them in, but I, I think I was just under like about 84. I might have got them, almost all of them in, but 84 or something like that. I don't know because I don't have the paper on me, and I know it's got to be in my notebook, my folder, where I keep all my Nutrisystem and all my tracking. Anyway, I just sat down and decided I'm going to go ahead and videotape this. Tonight is... Today's July 30th, 2014, and the time is, I don't know because I don't even have that. Like I said, I just sat down to do this. Um, oh, and I'm blind as a bat. I think it's almost 9 o'clock or almost 10, 8 o'clock. I don't know. Uh, doesn't matter, really. Um, I just got done about 30 minutes ago having, okay, for breakfast, I didn't have nothing today because I knew that... Um, I was going to have dinner cooked for me. Had no idea what they were doing. I knew it was going to be Mexican food, because I love it. Um, it was homemade refried refried beans, um, rolled tacos, uh, regular tacos. If you guys are a friend of mine on YouTube, I had a big platter, big enough to fit a turkey on, with a little bit of everything on it. And I had, all I did was have a quarter of the carne asada burrito. I had a bite of one of the uh, rolled tacos. I had some guacamole, probably about a cup of guacamole, or no, I'm sorry, a uh, quarter of a cup of guacamole. Um, I had some rice. Now, I did overdo it a little bit on the rice. Not really. I'm going to say I probably had about a cup of rice, and you know it was white rice. So... Basically, I, I, I think I'd overdid it on that and the guacamole because they're both, one's high in starch, which is the rice, the other one's high in fat. It's a healthy fat, it's a good fat, but, you know, whatever. I only had a quarter of the burrito. Oh, and I had a bite of the um, taco. But then again, that was earlier today. Okay, first I had, when I first got up, he made me um, a cheese quesadilla. And I cut it in half. It had very little cheese in it. I cut it in half. It was homemade tortillas, flour tortillas. I cut it in half, gave half to my, my four-year-old, because I didn't want to eat. You know, I'm trying to cut everything in half, portion control it. 
Um, I didn't weigh that out. I didn't weigh, really weigh any of my food out. I just, I, I know I'm probably at about 1,200 calories now because I ate that, and then I, at about 3 o'clock is when I had dinner, um, or lunch, I'm sorry, and then I had, uh, one bite of my cake, just one bite, because I'm not into sweets anyway, uh, I had one bite, I had buttercream frosting on it, it was really good, I'm not really into sweets, so that's why it doesn't bother me if I don't have any, um, and then, just a little while ago, I had the rest of my well, I'm going to say probably about a quarter of the burrito. And then I plan on maybe later, if I'm up, having another quarter of the, the, the other part of the burrito. Um, because it's not it, it, it's not really that big. It's only I mean, about that long. Probably about as long as a uh, dollar bill. But, I mean, it had, carne, it had meat in it. Uh, more veggies than anything. Oh, and then I had the pico de gallo, and, um, which was awesome. It was homemade. Everything was homemade. Like I said, even the tortillas, it was really good. It took me back to California, so, um, it took me back to, yeah, when I used to always eat, eat all that good Mexican food, and that's why I'm probably overweight now. But anyway, so I'll probably have a gain, I'm thinking, I'm thinking I probably, if I have the other quarter, which, which, if I do, um, I might not. I know I'm not going to have the rolled tacos that he made me, and I'm not going to eat no more beans, only, only had a couple of a spoonfuls, like teaspoonfuls of that, or regular, you know, small spoons, um, and basically that's about it, um, trying to think here, I don't know if I went over on the 1200, because I didn't weigh anything out, I mean, I couldn't, he had already made the food, it was pre-made, he didn't say come out and make your plate, which, which I wish he would have done, but that's okay, it's not a big deal, I mean, I could have just said, you know what, I'll let somebody else have that, I'll make mine so I can weigh it out, but no, I decided just to, you know, I only turn 50 once, right? Uh, birthday comes every year, but you only turn a certain age, and um, I'm over the hill now. I thought it was 51 where you're over the hill, but I guess 50 you're over the hill. But anyway, so yeah, I'm kind of like, not really bummed, but I guess I'm just emotional. Um, not crying emotional just because I'm my tummy's cramping nothing's happening with T.O.M. Tom um and basically that's about it I, I don't know what else to say I'm trying to think um got a lot of my mind <coughs> but I'm like wow where did the years go you know I'm 50 years old now I'm about to have a grandchild my first grandchild and it's it's exciting but I had a really good day today. What my husband got me, you I don't know if anybody's subscribed to me. If you're subscribed, not subscribed, but on my Facebook, he got me a game, well, a game I downloaded personally. And then um he got me a new food scale. My other one I dropped on me. Almost killed my broke my toe off. Uh and then um a birthday card, a nice dinner, a nice table piece. Basically, just a lot, you know, waiting on me hand and foot, which was awesome. And uh, I had a really good birthday party. I really did. A little get-together with family and friends, and I'm still supposed to have a few drinks tonight, but I don't know if I want to drink. <laughs> I really don't feel like it. My stomach's a little ugh, because I ate... What he cooked was really good, but when I took a bite of one of the tacos, that's why I said I won't eat those, um, it was a little, just a little too greasy. It, it wasn't that he greased, it was greasy from him cooking it. It just, you know, had the certain foods in it. I don't, I don't know, it was just too greasy for me, but I ate it. I mean, I ate a couple bites of uh, one of the rolled taco, one of the other taco, and then I had um, the carne asada, which, if you have Mexican food, it doesn't matter how much... If you cook with no grease, it's make the the meat makes its own grease. So it was an excellent, excellent meal. And if you're watching this, Tony, thank you. I do appreciate it. So, father of my first, he's my first husband, but um, we're just really good friends still. So, don't judge. <laughs> don't don't sit there and think that you know. No, I love my husband, but um, I do adore and love my ex husband too. He's the father of my kids. I love him like he's my brother. But anyway. 
Okay, well, I'm going to go ahead and leave it at that and just tell you guys that I, I don't think I went over my 1,200 calories today, but I didn't eat the healthiest foods, and that's not good. But you know what? Hey, I'm not going to beat myself up about it. If I gain, I gain. I'll just have to work harder to work that off. But I'm done. I might have the other quarter of the burrito. I just got done eating 30, 40 minutes ago, so I'm not, I don't see myself eating it right now, but who knows. But we'll see what happens Saturday. Maybe it'll help me break this plateau that I'm on. And, I don't know. Maybe eating that junk food will help me. My dog's going to start barking. He heard something out in the living room. Um, anyway, everybody stay positive, focused, motivated, determined, and on track. And I, like I said, I do apologize about not um, videotaping yesterday. I had people drop in that weren't expected. I had my daughter's friend that I hadn't seen in a while. Um, drop in, and then my daughter, and she was already here, but she went to pick up her friend later, and then my ex-husband, she went to pick him up at his place, and I was like, wow, you know, didn't expect that, and then he came over, you know, with food and, you know, stuff to cook, and I'm like, what are you doing? He said, he's making me dinner for, to, for today, so they're still here, they're going to leave tomorrow, go back to their places, and I just want to thank everybody, if, Sarah, I'm pretty sure you're subscribed to me, um, and everybody else on my YouTube that said, or on my Facebook that said happy birthday, I really do appreciate it, you guys are all awesome, new subscribers, old subscribers, subscribers that don't get on, if you happen to see this video, start making videos again, alright, I'm done, I'm rambling now. All right, everybody, I'll see you tomorrow for day 18. Yeah, today was 16 and 17. You really didn't miss much. I was under calories, and today I'm probably right at them. And I don't know. All I know is I'm eating some very small portions. I'm not overdoing it, so that's all that matters. All right, love you all. Huh. I, I don't know why I say that, love you all. But I do. I love you all. You all you're all awesome. Thanks for your continued support. And... Um, Stay po positive, focused, motivated, determined on the track. And um, I'm going to go out here and say hi to everybody. I don't want to feel like I'm letting them down, you know, abandoning them abandoning them on my birthday. But I am hopefully going to call it an early night tonight because I went to bed late and got up early. All right, talk to you all soon.